really simple kit, really tiny kit, but very impressive. Hello, this is BJ from Hearns Hobbies and welcome to another one of my unboxings. I'm going to look at this little tacker of a kit. This is from Bren Gun, which is a company from the Czech Republic and it's of the HO229 um, Horton Flying Wing. And this particular one is the A model, which is the Night Fighter. Okay, so let's have a closer look at it right there. So look at the, well it's a really, really small little kit because this is 1 to 144 scale. Now that's really quite tiny. It's not the most common um, or popular scale um, in Australia, but in Japan and also in Europe, this is very popular. It's nice and, and compact and I know a lot of people that collect these because they just like a lot of different aircraft. So obviously with being smaller, you don't need so much room for display. So let's open up and have a closer look. Okay, so obviously it's going to be a little, little box of parts. It's all in one bag. Now let's have a closer look in here. Now there's a little bit of photo etch. Get some decals. And that's it. So we've got two sprue. Got the fuselage, wings, you got your decals, and there's also the clear parts inside there as well. And then you've got a sheet of very simple instructions. Because as you imagine, there's not going to be much to this. So let's look at the individual bits first. Okay, let's bring those up tighter. Now, move that out of the way. Let's get into a bit of zoom. There we go. The thing about these is it's quite remarkable at how crisp they've actually made these. See all the panel lines? So the panel lines do look exaggerated because this is so tiny. Okay, so this is the bottom of the fuselage. This is going to be that big front um, undercarriage. You've got the rear undercarriage there as well. Got some of the struts. There's your wheels. Got some inserts for the engines. On the carriage doors. And you see how everything has some really nice fine detail in it. Absolutely remarkable for a model this size. There's the wings and the engine detail there again because there's two um, jet engines that power this. Then on the other side, you're not going to see much here because it's all going to be enclosed anyway. You can see the other side of the wheel there. It's got really crisp. Very impressive. Okay, so there's the fuselage and then we get into the wings. Now the wings are, are solid. And again, you can see really fine panel detail. You got a very very slight um, texture there to the surface. There's your um, front. Is it uh, part of the front undercarriage? There's the front wheel there, gigantic wheel. And you got the other side. Again, some nice crisp detail. Really simple, but really nice. Okay, so from there we're left with this one here, which has got the decals in it. So let me just take out this staple. And we'll have a closer look inside. So we've got clear parts. There's your clear parts. So you can see how they've Got the molded in frame on there as well. Just needs a very careful painting. I guess it's as clear as it can be because it's going to have additional thickness compared to a bigger kit. But I mean, I think it's fine for a 1 to 144 scale. And then we have the decals. There we go. 
It's got some numbers and some markings there. Can't actually see what these really tiny ones are here. And then we end up with the photo wedge, which is really tiny. See that there? So this is what differentiates this um, as a night fighter. This is the radar that was um, uh, protruding from the nose. You can see how absolutely thin that is. So you're going to have to be very careful when applying that. And I'm not sure, but they may need to be folded as well. Okay, so that's the contents of the kit. Let's have a quick look at the manual here. Okay, so unfolded, we've got this part here. This is the first section. This is the legend of all the parts. You've got your clear, you've got your, your wing sections, fuselage with all the components with their numbers. And then we get into the construction. So you're doing the interior. This is the engine nozzle detail that goes into the top of the fuselage. You've got the seat. And then you've got the halves of that put together. Wings attached, undercarriage getting put together, and then you finalize that with the undercarriage. So you've got the undercarriage doors, the front undercarriage, rear undercarriage getting glued into the fuselage, and then you finish off with all the finer details. Okay, so there's actually radar um, on the rear end as well. So actually quite a bit of uh, folding involved. And then there's also the clear fuselage. And then I'll show you a few of the other kits that they make too. So there we go. So that is my open box review of the little tiny 1 to 144 scale Horton HO229A, the Night Fighter. Which, really simple kit, really tiny kit, but very impressive. So there we go. Maybe you should give one of these a try. So thank you for watching.